Here we go with part four of the retro postcard. Now I just wanted to show you something really quick here. We did the eye. I have another layer here. I call the layer alligator. And I want to do this on a letter that's a little more difficult, like let's say the R for instance, where you have the curve and the straight lines. Come over here, and you have transparency right here. You can drop this transparency down and sort of position this where you're going to want it. Sort of like that. And go ahead and get your marquee here. Make sure you're on the alligator layer or whatever layer you're choosing. Come right up to here, delete, same thing like here, get the straight edges, delete, delete. Delete. See, I cut off too much there, so that's no good. Gotta be real careful here. So, let's see how I'm kind of cleaning it up there. <clears throat> Okay, now these other parts, you can kind of get these with the eraser. You can maybe make one, do one here. Get these flat edges. You do too much, you could always do a uh, control Z, redo it, really zoom in here, get it right on the edge. See, that's way too much. Way too much again. Get the flat pots. Okay, so once you do that, you can do these other parts by hand with the eraser. Real careful. And you may have to play with the size of the brush here. Okay, erase that. Get looking clean. You have to do this with each ladder, with each picture. We're almost done here. And see if you go too much there, just do Control Z, redo it.
be real careful. Let's see how that looks. Put the uh, transparency back up. Not too bad. Messed up a little bit, but you could always hit it with this. And you can resize it a little bit too. Play around with it. So there you go. Hope that helps. Do that with each letter, different picture in each letter.